What's up you guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Cecily and in today's video we are talking shapewear. I did a video on Spanx shapewear a couple of years ago and I really wanted to update this because also my view on shapewear changed a little bit. So in this video we will be discussing shorts type of shapewear because what I have come to experience in my lifestyle and just the way that I get dressed and the occasions that I feel like a shapewear is needed, mostly I gravitate towards my shorts shapewear. So I have a pair of shorts from H&M, which are a very light kind of shapewear. These are the ones that I have been recommending like over and over again, especially like if you have a lot of legs like me and you love wearing dresses, but in the summer, if you have like a lot of legs, you know that in the summer, they rub against each other and it's just it can get very painful so for those occasions i would always wear a light shaping short like this however like i said this is a light shaping shorts but sometimes you need just a little bit more of a pick me up just a little bit more smoothing and you know smoothing out all the bumps and the lumps and a little bit of lifting here and there so that's what i'm a look out for today i still have this pair from Spanx. This is like a full bodysuit, also with the shorts, but I really don't wear this, you know, maybe once a year at the most, maybe once every two years. I don't know. Just because of the hassle, you know, like if I'm going to like a very special occasion, say a wedding, something like that, and I'm wearing like a very tight fitting body contrast, then maybe I'll, you know, reach for this. So that's why I still have it in my collection, my shapewear collection just for in case you know because these can get very expensive so if you have one that you like but you don't really wear it a lot i would say you just keep it because you never know it might come in handy so as you can see with this right here if i don't do anything with my belly you can see there is some belly action right here and i also remember in the previous video that i did a lot of people commented that i don't need any shapewear and this and that and i completely disagree i think that shapewear is just that extra layer of protection you're not deceiving anyone it's just for me makes me feel very confident when i'm wearing like something tight fitting i just feel way better in it so i don't understand what's wrong with that it's just as wearing bra or underwear it's just another type of underwear so yeah but you can see right here you can see a little bit of my belly button but not really and i love that because also because this material is a little bit on the thick side but let's see let's see if these um the pair of shorts that i have will do a little bit of smoothing in this underbelly area for today, we are trying on like a couple of shorts from brands like Commando, Wakol, which I've uh, never tried before, but I heard it's like a brilliant lingerie brand. So I'm very curious to try that one out, but also Spanx, Skims. So the first one that I want to try out is the one from Wakol because I told you I've heard so many great things and I really am eager to try it. And this is the reshape fit and lift high waist long leg shaper and of course i'll leave everything linked below along with the sizes and everything like that if i forget but this is in a size medium and the only thing that i'm maybe concerned about is that around the waist it does have a seam so that sometimes can really dig in if it's not like the right size or whatever but around the the leg part it is seamless so let me just put this on and we'll talk about it all right so i do really like it i do think that around the belly area it is a little bit smoother gives a little bit more definition in the smallest part of my waist and also the bum looks spectacular i just love when you know you can get a, like an extra layer i feel way more confident wearing dresses like this because when i walk because let's be honest like i'm a little i'm a little jiggly <laughs> so when i walk like if i have a shapewear like this 
I can just walk super comfortably, not everything is jiggling. So um, that's like one of also one of the main reasons I love wearing like that extra layer underneath. Oh, also it doesn't roll down. Like I did a couple of tests trying to see if it will roll down, but it has a technology on the inside. I can show you. Also the, the length is quite good. You won't see anything, don't worry. But it has like this, lining on the inside that I think that prevents it from rolling down because it is a little bit of a grippy kind of material normally well with Spanx and Skims sometimes they put like you know that clear kind of plasticky thing like not a grip thing that they put around the waistband but I don't feel like that really helps with, especially with Spanx, I always like experience that it will roll down anyway. Also, because of the waistband, I thought that it is not seamless, but I thought that it would give like an indentation right here, but because it's like super high-waisted, it pretty much comes here, so underneath my bra, you won't really see it, right? Unless you're wearing maybe something, like even if I do this, you don't really see it. It was very easy to put on. So that's also another thing that I look for because I, like when I'm getting dressed, I don't want to think too much about it. Like if I'm wearing a dress and I have to wear shapewear underneath it, I don't have to think, oh, I can't wear this because then I can't really go to the restroom, things like that. So shapewear for me needs to be convenient. And I would say I rather like, in the past, I used to go a size down to really get that snatchery. However, like in my lifestyle, I have experienced that I don't, because it's like so hard to get on and off, I just don't reach for my shapewear often, especially in the summer and it's like hot and things like that. So go through to size or even go like a size higher i would say like medium for me is perfect i can um i still feel like very just the protection and the compression but it's not like a struggle to get <laughs> on and off all right let's do commando next i have two from commando and commando is another brand that i really like like i have their tights i think i also have a had a bodysuit or something like that oh i also have like leather leggings shiny leggings and they have some good stuff this one is light compression smoothing properties for the real woman fit test i don't know what that is okay so this one doesn't really have a specific name or whatever but it's very similar to the one from H&M. So it's pretty much the same. The one from H&M, but in black. So I'm very curious to know if it gives a little bit more compression than the one from H&M. All right, so this one is literally H&M, but it's just more expensive. Like, if I'm being completely honest, this gives the same effect of the one from H&M. It's nice for sure, but it's just like that light shapewear that you can use every day it's not like really give you giving you a lot of compression but i love that like it's not every day that you want to be like sucked in and feeling suffocated so this is like perfect for every day this is the next one from commando it's also it pretty much looks the same but around the waist it is way stiffer so i know that that gave a little bit more compression and it's called zone smoothing i think i also got it everything i got in a size medium but yeah let me just put this on all right this one i think the material is much better i can really see the difference and by the way guys i don't know if you're really seeing much of a difference between the shaper so far i don't think you will because it's like a very tiny nip and tuck here and there it's not going to be like these are not your heavy duty kind of shaper so you're not going to see like the most incredible kind of difference but i really try to describe what i'm seeing and what i'm feeling and i can show you like what this one has it has like right here a little bit of i don't know it is kind of a texture but in some way it's like really doing something to like my underbelly just give, making it a little bit um smoother for sure and 
it ju it's just way thicker also than the previous one so definitely this one i would say is worth it again it is a little bit more expensive but um it's not as expensive as the first one and i can totally like feel the difference in the quality and just the way it fits it's like way also way more comfortable than the one from h&m i don't know what it is in the material but this uh for sure i can wear like hours and hours on and i don't even feel that i'm wearing something it's just very crazy to me so definitely would recommend this one for sure if you are looking for a shaping short that's a little bit on the lightweight side but still gives you a little bit of that oomph you know a little a little pick me up definitely this one is a this is a good one all right let's do spanx next because i know you've been waiting for the spanx and this is the thing that i was referring to you know the strip that's like the anti-slip strip <laughs> but this one is the Tin Stinks 2.0 and this is the shapewear that you see whenever you type the best shapewear this is like really one of the first ones that will come up in all of the different blog lists and glamour and folk and all of that so I think I tried this one before but not this newer version I think this is a newer version because I haven't seen this design so yeah let's see uh, how this fits okay so this one is definitely a little bit harder to get in but once you have it on it is very comfortable you can definitely see some compression right here it's like super smooth I would say I think that's very nice very smooth for sure it comes up way high like all the way up here you can see because i have kind of more of a shorter kind of torso you can see that it is doing a little bit of bunching up right here so for me it is a little bit too long so if they ever bring out a design that's specifically for shorter torsos i think that will fit me better i love the color because it's like a very nice skin color for me that's like something that Spanx has really been paying attention to and other than that it doesn't roll down it's like very comfortable around this area as well even though it's like very high personally I wouldn't go for this one because it gives kind of the same effect as the second one from Commando I think the one from Commando is like way easier to get in and out of which is like something that is important to me all right so the both from uniqlo have the same name uniqlo is not very creative when it comes to the names <laughs> they are both called let me see real quick arism body silhouette shaper half shorts but this one the first one has like a waistband you can clearly like see it right here and this second one has like a super different waistband which is seamless it has some kind of design i don't know if that's supposed to do anything but around the legs they are both seamless so i'm going to try this one first with the waistband okay so this one from uniqlo with the waistband is not i'm not the biggest fan because you can clearly see you can clearly see an indentation right here you can also see it has like a v seam um right here and you can see that's true the dress as well so yeah it's not as seamless as i would have liked around the legs it is seamless and it is very comfortable very easy to put on and off but again it is a light shape wear so i would expect that but um yeah just this thing right here and the waistband especially if you sit you will clearly see it right there so this is a no for me all right this one i like much better you can see it is very seamless right here you don't see like a waistband if you really have something tight 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 maybe you can see the seams right here it does have like a little bit of a seam but I don't think that you can really see it 
and uh, when it comes to the comfort again very comfortable it is very comparable to the one from H&M not sure which one is more comfortable I think they are both kind of the same also the same price range so I would say these are like pretty much identical so it really depends on whichever brand you prefer whichever brand is like accessible to you these two are like very very similar all right you guys we are in a little bit of a different setting because it's a couple of days later and i still needed to receive a package from skims and this is like the piece that i've been really wanting to try this is a new design from skims it is like a built-in corset so i am like looking at it and feeling it it is very stiff so i think this is going to really snatch you in and it has like a zipper in the back so let me just try this on and let's see if it's going to do what it's promising to do unfortunately <laughs> this is not it you can see right here it is just way too big i think it is big for me around the smallest part of my waist like if you sit or whatever it will really bunch up and just also these um i don't remember how you call this like in a corset i don't remember but this you will see you will definitely see it through maybe not this dress really but if you have something super tight you will see it for sure and the only thing that i really like is that it's seamless around the legs because i've tried shorts from like sculpting shorts or, or whatever it's called from skims before but they really like become very tight around the the legs gives an indentation it does not look cute so this at least is seamless the material is very nice and thick though it's not like a mesh see-through kind of material so i do feel very supportive in it but yeah the thing that it was supposed to do around the waist just like really snatch it in it really is not doing so yeah this is the following pair that i got and this is called the barely there shapewear mid-thigh short and it is very high-waisted so that means that even though this band right here is not seamless it will come like all the way up so you won't maybe really see that and also at the legs it's seamless so this is like more of a lightweight everyday kind of shaping short so yeah very curious to see how this one fits okay so this one is also too long for my torso my torso is not even that short my torso is like kind of average for my height but you can see it's bunching up right here and if i really pull it up it will come all the way to my boobs so yeah i don't know what uh, what that is and the moment i saw it i thought you know the torso part is like pretty long so yeah but the leg area is nice it is very easy to put on and off yeah also this color is nice for my skin tone so that's like the one thing that i really well not the only thing but something that i really love about skins is all the different skin tones that they have because you can really find something that's pretty close to your skin tone but yeah i don't think this is going to work because of course this is not what you want so i think the other options are way better all right so trying on all the different shapewear i would say my favorite one was the one from commando that's a little bit tighter i would say that one i would use for more special occasions date nights things like that but for every day i think that the one from uniqlo and the one from h&m those are pretty much the same i do think that they are also a very good bang for your buck the fit is nice it just gives you again that extra layer of protection if you're looking for that i think those are like phenomenal options on the high street market and yeah so i do have a bonus i also got this skims bodysuit because i love bodysuits and i've heard so many great things about this particular one so i really wanted to try it out and it's not like a short shapewear but it's still a shapewear so i'm going to try it out and let's see if this is something 
All right, you guys, this wasn't my intention at all because usually I like to start with the best item first just to keep you guys watching, but I think we saved the best for last in this one because I'm in love with this bodysuit. The way that this snatches you in the waist is just incredible. And I was looking for something with a little bit of more tummy control and I found it. This is perfect. Like I can even wear this and wear like a black short, like the Uniqlo shaping shorts, for example, over it. And then whatever, like my skirt. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. So wear this like an actual bodysuit. So not as a underwear, as an actual bodysuit. And then if I want an extra layer, depending on the bottoms that I have, I can easily wear the Uniqlo shaping shorts over it to give, you know, a little bit of more protection or extra layer around the legs. Like that combination I think is beautiful. Also because the shaping shorts from Uniqlo or H&M are so easy to get on and off. This bodysuit has like the little clasp and the crotch so you can take it on and off super quick. So that's like the thing that I was looking for. I'm just now realizing, I don't know where I was, but instead of getting like a whole bodysuit, the hassle of tape putting that on and off is just way too much. It's better this way to get just two pieces and you know, you get the same kind of effect. And the nice thing again is that this bodysuit you can wear on its own, but you can also wear it underneath clothes like dresses if you have something tight fitting. This actually, I think around the waist is taking a couple of centimeters off because it's just so good. It's just, I don't know where I've been because this, this product is I think one of the first products that Skims launched, but I, I don't know why but i don't think i've ever tried it and until now and i'm hooked <laughs> so yeah i really really love this one so you can see here at the waist i mean look at that look at the waist this is <laughs> this is incredible and i added sticky bras underneath just to give my breast area a little bit of shape make it a little bit more feminine otherwise it's just a flat chest in the back it is like a little bit lower so super sexy for like hot summer days if you want to look you know a little bit snatched on top of it something like super flowy on the bottom this is perfect and i was also thinking of you know i can wear it with a blazer i will wear everything with a blazer and just make it look so much better. Well, depending on what you're going for, but if it's a, li a little bit chillier, I want to cover myself up, this is what I'll do. So yeah, I'm so happy with this one. This wasn't what I was expecting, but I'm pleasantly surprised. All right, you guys, that's it for this video. I really hope that you saw like you got a little bit of a direction in case you're looking for shapewear, especially shapewear shorts. I definitely found a new brand. Well, not a new brand, but a new pair of shaping shorts. The one from Commando and the one actually two. Also the one from Uniqlo, which I absolutely love. I can 100% recommend those. And also this beautiful bodysuit is going to be in my collection. Like I think for the foreseeable future. So get ready for the styling videos because they are coming. But yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.